Previously on Red Dead Redemption. You're about to meet God. <laughs> and so we continue. He didn't ask for a ride, he said he was lost, but then he was charging at me. Come on. Señor. You want trouble, friend? Manos arriba. Atlas. Tranquilo. Tranquilo, amigo. Tranquilo. Ya lo tengo. Mueva ese cabrón. El mundo es muy difícil. Mm. Tenemos que jugarlo bien. Uh -huh. Oh, Mr. Marston, I knew you would come. Thanks for the welcoming committee. I'm sorry, we cannot be too careful. The world is very dangerous. Especially when you greet it with a gun. Please. Mr. Marston. My father was killed yesterday. The army found him and accused him of treason. They cut out his heart and fed it to their dogs. I ended in this. Then he took the honor of two young girls. I'm sorry to hear that, Louisa. My father must not die in vain. His death must mean something. It'll mean that war is brutal and unnecessary and good people die. And that's all it will mean. That is not enough. Well, you know I'll do whatever I can, but I have problems of my own. We all have problems. This is about the people. My father died for his people. For these men and for millions like them, that they may be free. While there are guns and money, there won't be any freedom, Louisa. Mr. Marston, the movement is on the brink of great victory. Allende knows this and has sent for reinforcements. Abraham Reyes asked personally that you stop them reaching Escalera. They are coming by the old trail. You must ambush them. I have my own family to worry about. Mr. Marston, I have lost my father. My mother is in the United States. My sister has fled. I have no family, just because. Please, good actions make you a good man. Then I'm doomed. But I will help you out of respect for your loss. Thank you, Mr. Marston. Thank you. Let's go. We do not have much time to prepare the ambush. I didn't really talk to him on the fucking right. Oh, there you go. His death must not be in pain. Now we shall fight even harder to win power for Abraham. I admire your devotion. He is a true revolutionary. A man who puts the needs of others before his own. A man who fights out of love rather than hate. But you know this already. I heard about the battle at Chuparrosa. How he killed nearly a hundred soldiers to save your life. It'll go down in legend. I'm sure of that. Can I trust you, Mr. Marston? In 
what, what? You have done so much for me and my family, but I still can't forgive you for helping Allende, for what you did to the rebels. I'm here for two men, that's it. Not to take sides. And certainly not to fight a war that isn't mine. It makes no sense. You make a choice by not making a choice, you know. Linde betrayed me. I saw him do bad things. Things that disgust even me. Allende is pura maldad. One day I will cut his heart out. But me, you, him, we're all shooting people. It don't really seem like we're so very different. The difference is why, Mr. Marston. The ideals we hold, there can never be revolution without blood. Until people forget what they're shooting for, they just enjoy killing for its own sake. You Americans forget too quickly. That is the problem. If it wasn't for your revolution, you would still be making tea for the English. At least we knew where we stood. It's more difficult to understand why your own people treat you like shit. It is the same here. We fought off the Spanish. We fought off the French. We even fought off the Americans. Finally, Mexico won its independence, and all we've done since then is fight each other. At least you're keeping up tradition. It will end when Abraham takes control. When the Spanish left, we renamed this province Nuevo Paraíso, New Paradise. One day, it will live up to its name. Him and Arthur. There they are. And Red Dead Redemption too. He was also uh, fucking setting up TNT again. On the road. Please tell them where to place it. I'll be waiting up above, watching for the wagons. Okay, follow me, gentlemen. Vamos, the laws were to place it. Convoy will be here soon. Very one right here. Another one here. And that may cause a chain reaction, you know. Another one here. One here. Go meet Luisa at the detonator. We will handle the rest. Todos a sus posiciones. Somehow they're rigged to this. Get ready, John. Every time again they hit us, we hit him back. Sometimes harder. rigged with with the fuse. <laughs>
Marston. We are a step closer to power. My father would be very proud. I hope it was worth it. I must return to Campo Mirada. Meet me there when you can. I will do my best to return the favor. Ah, Master! John! John! Thank God you have come. That wretched animal, the Santa, has been sent to oversee a massacre in El Sepulco. Come, we must stop him and finally kill that vermin and all of Allende's other followers. Hurry! I don't know how much time we have. Let's go! Maybe the Santa can tell you where to find Javier Escuela. It is good that you are helping Luisa. It ain't right what happened to her father. She's a brave girl. She can fight as well as any man. She ain't the only woman I've seen fighting for Reyes. Yes, women, even children. Everybody must become a soldier if we are to win this war. That's a lot to sacrifice. I just hope it's worth it. It is better to die free than live as slaves. on weekends. It was impressive what you did at the bridge, destroying that convoy. The army is getting weaker by the day. I'm sure there's more supplies where those came from. We will destroy those too? Again, they're scared and making mistakes. We are closer to victory than you think. Let's go. Yeah. No talking now, compadre. We must stay alert. En el nombre del gobierno provincial del coronel Allende y del estado de este país, te condeno a muerte por traición. ¿Tienes algunas últimas palabras? No. Come on, quick.
You hear me? Quick! Do not let him get away! I am no use to you! You're making a big mistake! Think about what you are doing! Now you're coming with me! My men will kill you! Come on! Understand that. Easy. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> of shit now, senor? Or would you like to pleasure yourself? Please! Go ahead. I, I don't you. care. I don't care about it. It's not my problem. He's all yours, fellas. I got what I need. Esto es para Mexico! It is done. Come on. Now we find your friend. Why are you stopping? Let's go. Javier Escuela. He hasn't been seen around here in months. You shut up this place for him, huh? I wouldn't spit on him if he was on fire. I don't blame you. The Captain DeSantis said he was here. <laughs> and you believe him? You must be more stupid than you look. <laughs> Go shoot up some place else. <coughs> I hope we can say I'm a friend. Listen, you creep. 
It's not your money we want. It's your ass. I'm sorry to hear that. What the fuck is this piece of shit? Like, comment, and subscribe, or I'll break your fucking legs.